promoting his new movie The Public. The actor suggested the future of his Trump impression on SNL is unclear. Alec Baldwin's feature on Saturday Night Live impersonating Donald Trump may be more unclear than that of the actual Trump presidency. Speaking to IndieWire to promote his new film with director Emilio Estevez, The Public, the conversation pivoted to his portrayal of the president. We're not doing a David Fincher movie here, or a Soderbergh movie, where we're gonna edge some finely rendered impersonation of Trump, Baldwin said, when asked about how his impression has changed in the more than two years he's been playing Trump. I made him as two-dimensional as I believe he deserves to be made, and we've certainly vulgarized it from time to time, beyond certain limitations. But it's essentially us repeating back what he says, and just holding up a mirror to what he says and does. The actor also suggested that, of his own choice, he's dialing back the frequency of his SNL appearances. We did it like once a month. This season, Baldwin said, last season, I did it a bunch. And the season before that, the first season, I did it almost every show. I think I did it every show. And I think people are, uh, oh, they want a little bit less of that. And whether I do it much longer, remains to be seen. I don't, interestingly enough, the same thing apply there, as everywhere else. If the writing is good, Baldwin appeared most recently on SNL March 30th, portraying the president celebrating and tweeting about the conclusions that came out of the Mueller report. This year is said to be a busy one for the actor, with not only the release of the public in select cinemas April 5th, but Dan Argett and Sheena M. Joyce's biopic framing John DeLorean, out June 7th, and a role in Edward Norton's second directorial effort, Motherless Brooklyn, set to be released November 1st, and the 2020 presidential election is 19 months away.